Hi, I'm Debbie Sternholm, and I'm the owner and founder of Seahorse Counseling and Consulting. Seahorse Counseling and Consulting offers an innovative way of doing employee training or professional counseling with the use of horses. That's right, horses. And it has nothing to do with horseback riding or horsemanship, but it has to do with people participating in ground activities with a horse and through the process of the activities, not the activities themselves, people go away learning all kinds of things about themselves, what works, what doesn't, relationships, communication styles, things that they may have never known about themselves before. Horses mirror the nonverbal activities of people, the nonverbal messages that people give during the activities, thereby they offer immediate and honest feedback to the people. So whether you're doing employee training or professional counseling, it's solution focused, it's experiential, it's done with a team approach, myself and a horse professional, Dee Kirby is my partner. It's effective as people are moved out of their comfort zones and into an arena or outdoors, participating in activities, doing something rather than just talking about it. So it's an incredibly innovative, fun way of learning. So what you're going to do is your, your job, each team is going to select one horse. And your job will be to get that horse into one of those pins without touching the horse, touching any apparatus on the horse, without talking to one another, and without bribing the horse or simulating bribing the horse. Then I want you to think of the team, the pen, as the epitome of success. That's your demarcation of success. I want you to think of the horse. The horse might represent something different to each of you, but I want the horse to represent your problem or issue or the thing that you're wanting to address, okay? And I want you to think about what positive strengths do each of you bring into achieving this goal. Okay. Get ready, go! Stop. Let's come on back here for a moment. Did you guys feel successful with the exercise? Somewhat successful. Yeah. I mean, I thought, you know, I mean, we were close two times to getting her into the stall. I, mean, I don't necessarily, we, we didn't get her all the way in. Mm -hmm. But I thought relatively successful. She followed us or we got her to go somewhere. Right. So again, think about how each person might have a different definition of success what that was like for you with some of the traditional methods of communication being prohibitive, how, how did you find your communication with each other? Any final comments before we wrap it up? I was skeptical coming in how this was going to relate to outside of here. Um, you know, I really wanted to see how it was. And I had a friend of mine, actually, many years ago, kind of took a similar course, and he just raved about it. And I can see why now, because it's... It, it, we talk about the problem, but it's really about how I'm addressing that problem that, that makes it really a problem because the problem is either I've defined it as a problem, not anybody else, you know. So it's a great class. And after going through the, the session, I mean, I can think right now of, of several people, companies that do like corporate trainings where they have like a department that they want. I mean, I'm, I'm going to call them and say, you got to try this out.
give us a call and let us show you what the horses can teach you. Thanks for listening.